What is up guys, it's your boy Sprite here. I want to come and show you guys a new glitch on Call of Duty Ghost. It's called the Invincibility Glitch. Before it starts up, can we at least try to get 50 likes on this video? That will help us out a lot. But anyways, these are the settings, S and D. Now, if the settings are going too quick for you, don't be afraid to pause the video and look at it. So, this is important. You're going to want to go to Custom Default Loadout. You're going to want to toggle Bomb Carry. You'll press X, a star will go over it because you toggled it. Now you, this is also very important, you want to put a Trini rocket on the class. You can change anything else on it, you can put a sniper or a running class, whatever you want to do, but you need that Trini rocket. After you have these settings, you want to start up the game. Now that you're in the game, whoever is going to be doing the invincibility glitch, you're going to need to have the bomb. But once, once you spawn in, you're going to want to go over to the person that's helping you and you're going to want to kill him seven times but when you're going over there do not grab the bomb leave the bomb at the spawn as you can see cod spots he is running over he's going to kill me seven times to get the trinity rocket also this shouldn't take as long as it took us i was messing around with him trying to kill him so yeah once you do it it shouldn't take as long as long as you're just if you want to do it and you want to get it done it shouldn't take long but as soon as he gets his trinity rocket or as soon as you get your trinity rocket whoever's helping you your friend or whoever you want to do this with is helping you you want them to knife you this is very important you want them to knife you which this will then switch you into the bomb carrier class that you toggled in the settings now this part right here is all about timing you're going to want to pull out your trinity rocket and move over the bomb as soon as you do this it will spawn you in again and have him knife you. You will know when you do it right is when you time it right and as soon as he knifes you you'll f you'll see your body fall and you'll still be alive. It'll show in the kill feed that he knifed you but you'll be alive still. But as you can see I'm trying to knife him. He's invisible and he has invincibility. Now once you get knifed though you'll have no gun. Just press Y you'll pull out your secondary now if you want to trick shot or just run around and you want a different gun just press X over a gun you'll be able to pick it up. Now you're going to want to go over to the map or wherever you're at on the map you're going to want to jump off. You get past the death barriers as you can see he has invincibility and you can go anywhere outside the map. Uh, this is you can use this for trick shotting you know to make a private match episode. Uh, you can also do this for trolling or just to show off to your friends. Um, he's taking you to a trick shot spot right now. It's decent. It's all right. You can see him from outside of the map while he's inside the map. Um, yeah, that's about it. You can go anywhere outside the map that you want to. Uh, also, uh, I think you want to. You might want to be careful of how far you go outside of the map because there is some parts where you can fall and you'll continuously fall into a black abyss, which you will have to switch teams to spawn back in. And that's about it so yeah don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe if you're new it's been your boy sprite peace